Samantha has $3.23. She wants to buy Shopkins that costs $4.62. How much money does Samantha need in order to buy her Shopkins? Today we are going to use place value chips to solve this problem. Okay, so first we're going to change our settings from basic to place value chart to help us solve the problem. And next, since we're dealing with decimals, we also have to change it to decimals here. We know that the Shopkins cost $4.62. That's $4. And we need to have $0.62. Cents. That's $0.40. Cents. That's $0.60. Cents. And 61 62 cents. To find out how much money she needs, we need to subtract $3.23 from $4.62. We can subtract two hundredths, but we need to subtract one more hundredth. We can regroup one tenth. So, I will regroup one tenth to make tenth hundredths. There are now a total of twelve hundredths. There are now a total of five tenths. I can now subtract three hundredths from twelve hundredths. Remember, use good place value language. When I take away three hundredths from twelve hundredths, there is nine hundredths left. I can now subtract three tenths from five tenths. There is three tenths left. Now we see that there are three tenths and nine hundredths, which makes thirty nine hundredths. We subtract three from four. We are left with one dollar. Now we can see that Samantha needs $1.39 to buy her Shopkins. Using place value chips, we were able to find out that Samantha needs $1.39 to buy her Shopkins. For more student math strategy videos, check out our UH Math Education channel.